Thank you for visiting West Coast Auto Enthusiast. Today we're featuring a 2011 BMW 128 convertible. This is a BMW certified car, meaning it's got an extended BMW factory warranty until December of 2016. So the end of this calendar year, or 100,000 miles, it's only got 40,000 miles on it, so it'll probably expire on time. It's a clean title, clean Carfax. It has excellent service history uh, on the Carfax report, uh, non-smoker. We can finance this car through Alaska Federal Credit Union, and I can put an extended warranty on it. Uh, we also welcome trades. So we like the one series. Um, they, they really come in three options, although you'll probably only see two of them. They come in a 128 and a 135. They do make a 1M, but they're very uncommon. So we like them. They were introduced in 2008 and ran through 2013, and then they were replaced by the 2 Series. So we bought this car out of Texas. We've started going to Texas to get some of our cars. Uh, it's a good luxury car market. It's kind of similar to Southern California and Nevada. Uh, a lot of luxury cars in that area. and. Um, so we're diversifying, I guess you could say. This is a space gray metallic paint. It's got four new Continental tires on it. All the wheels are in good shape. There's no curb rash on any of them. It's got 40,000 miles on it. This is a sport package car. You can tell that you've got black trim on your, uh, your mirror caps here and you have uh, black trim uh, around your windows. And then you're gonna notice uh, when I get in, you'll notice the uh, it's got a sport seat. So it's really, really clean. It's current on its service. So the 128 is just a standard six cylinder engine. The 135 is a twin turbo. And uh, if you're not familiar with these, they were, re they, they were designed and introduced in 2008 in commemoration of the old uh, 1970s, 2002 car. And their BMW produced a whole book on it actually, um, explaining the, the idea and the design. So you can see it's really clean. It's been very well cared for. Probably enthusiast owned. You can see the, the back here, no oxidation or any kind of wear or damage. So the body's in really good shape, as is in the, the interior. So the back seats, uh, I'm going to assume anything you're going to look at in a 1 Series is going to be in really good shape in the back seat because they don't get used. They're just too small. Uh, although you could get kids in them. So your door panel, this uh, it's got, of course it's got power windows, mirrors and locks. This button here means you've got a power folding mirror so you hit that, turns your mirrors in. That's handy when you're downtown or parking. So a sport seat, yeah, familiar with BMWs, this exaggerated bolster here and here uh, means you've got sport package on your car. This has actually got a diaphragm in it that's controllable by a button down here that you can inflate and deflate so you can kind of squeeze yourself into the seat. And then this is lumbar and then these are your power seat settings and then you've got a driver's side memory seat. Um, so I've got one master key. I do have the books for this car. So, automatic Steptronic transmission. Uh, let me turn the lights on. So you've got dual heated seats, dual auto climate control. This is your top operation. I'll put the top up at the end of the video so you can see that it's working. So you've got your tuner, you've got satellite radio, CD, you've got an aux input and a USB for uh, Bluetooth or iPod. And then you also have Bluetooth, an onboard computer, your configuration and BMW Assist. You can see the passenger side door is really clean, the dash. Super clean, really clean car. So multi-function steering wheel, uh, ability to scroll through radio stations or CDs, programmable uh, button here. Over here you've got cruise, voice activation, and Bluetooth, and volume control. Did I say cruise? Not cruise. Voice activation, Bluetooth, and volume control. You have a paddle shifter here. This is a down shift. This is an up shift. Over on the right, your onboard computer. Your cruise is down here and you have a manual tilt and telescoping wheel. So your onboard computer, you can scroll through, you can see 41,237 miles. Uh, driving lights, fog lights, automatic headlights. And then uh, another optional piece of equipment on this particular car is the Harman Kardon sound. So that's a premium sound system. They've got three levels, I think. They're regular, they're hi-fi, and then Harman Kardon is their top um, line for this particular version. 
So to hit the top, you just put that in park. You can probably do it in drive, actually. You hit that and just hold it. It's going to bring your top up. I think it takes 12 seconds, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe it's 14 seconds. There you go. Tops up. You have a button over here on uh, BMW convertibles that operates all four windows at once. So you hit that and put all four windows up at one time. That's it. I'm going to turn that off. I'll get out and show you the top. So the top is really clean. No signs of wear and tear. I've got a number of pictures. You'll be able to see the glass in the back is really clean. No marks. The top itself doesn't have any pinch points in it. No signs of wear. So, anyways, really super fun car for the summer. They get great gas mileage. They're really fun to drive with a short wheelbase, plenty of horsepower. Uh, if you've got questions or would like additional information on this car, please feel free to contact us and we can be reached at 503 227 2354. Thank you for visiting West Coast Auto Enthusiast.